McDavid knee pads back again. See what I mean? I love these knee pads. Like you can see them, but you can't see them too much. It's not like they're big and bulky, but they still they still do the job. In today's tutorial, we're going to be learning some knee rocks. Welcome back again, ladies and gentlemen. I am AJ47 from Soul Mavericks Crew, London, England. Today, we're going to be covering some knee rocks. I do recommend getting the knee pads I've just shown at the beginning of the video, the McDavid knee pads. The link will be in the description down below. Okay? So, first of all, sitting in position zero, um, I'm going to go over the angles with you first. So, from here, I'm going to be facing this direction, and then I'm going to be facing the side, then the back, then this side, then the front again. So for example, before I explain exactly what I'm doing, I'm gonna go this way, see how I'm facing this way, then I'm gonna turn this way, facing this way. Now I'm gonna face this way, like so, and then back to the front, like so. So you're changing sides four times to make a complete circle. Now let me break down the step for you, really easy. Again, knee pads, because the step is not that fun without them. So sitting from position zero, I'm gonna swing around. I'm gonna land on my toe first. Toe to knee, toe to knee. Notice how my legs are at the side. Knees are pointing this direction. Same thing is gonna be going this way, but I'm gonna be going to position zero again. So I'm gonna land, because I'm going counterclockwise, I'm gonna land on my right leg first. Watch this, I'm gonna push off my left, off my left toe, rather than the knee, push off the left toe. Right foot, left foot. Okay, notice how I'm slightly elevated, a little bit rather than being sunk all the way, okay? Slightly elevated so I can swing again because I'm going one, two, and then I'm going three, four, okay? Once again, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now, the upper body allows you to twist faster. So rather than going like this and then jumping, try and have a twist. So if I'm facing you guys, watch. If I'm facing you guys, here, I'm still kind of facing you, and then I'm gonna change hands and face the other direction. Okay, see how that allows me to turn really fast. Same again. Okay, nice. And this is how you do it in a circle. Recommend learning it in both directions, it's a lot of fun. Same again, but you're just gonna change the angle of where your toe goes. So instead of going over here somewhere, it's gonna go somewhere around here. The step is really musical as well. Um, so when we're doing it side to side, for example, I'm going to go toe to my knee, toe to my knee, all right? So it goes toe to knee, toe to knee. Then this hand is going to go from here. And as this goes down, this hip swings up, up, okay? Like this. Then I jump back. So this is landing on the snare. I mean, you can change it. You can variate it like here, however you prefer. But learn the basic one first. Land to here on the snare. Then it goes boom, 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 ta. I'm looking at you guys and then I twist my body around to face you again. So it's, it's like a, you guys were my opponent for this example. Thank you very much for watching ladies and gentlemen. I do hope you found this tutorial helpful. Subscribe if you're new, like the video if you like it. The knee pads are linked in the description down below. So are the trainers. I hope you've had fun with this uh, tutorial. Play with it, change it up, switch it about. Happy trainings, stay fresh, peace. <laughs>